In this tutorial you will learn how to generate a TLS certificate via Let's Encrypt. In the administration interface log in using your credentials. Go to the server menu and select configure. On the left click on Let's Encrypt. Check the checkbox to enable Let's Encrypt certificate generation. If you don't already have a Let's Encrypt account, you need to create it. Click on the Generate New Account button. You need to input at least one contact URL and specify which ACME protocol directory. The URL in this case must be an email address, which must begin with mail to colon. The ACME directory might be either Let's Encrypt Production, Let's Encrypt Staging or a custom one. Let's Encrypt recommends testing against their staging environment before using their production environment. Select Custom if you want to use a provider that is compatible with Let's Encrypt. Accepting Let's Encrypt terms is mandatory. Click on the link to learn more. Let's Encrypt generates your certificate. To prove that the domain name for which you are requesting the certificate is under your control you need to select a challenge method. You can either use an internal, minimal web server created on the fly by FileZilla server, or use an already running web server whose file system FileZilla server has access to. Go to Protocol Settings, FTP and FTPS, and in the Connection Security tab from the TLS Certificate top-down menu, select Use Let's Encrypt Certificate. Click on the Generate New button and enter one or more host names. Then click the OK button. The internal web server must be reachable from the internet. Make sure that the IP addresses associated to your host names are properly routed to the FileZilla server. If everything works you'll get the certificate. Click the OK button to start using the new certificate. The log will show that a new certificate has been generated. FileZilla server is fast and reliable and it supports FTP and FTPS. Download it from FileZilla website, or you can also buy the manual. Stay tuned for the next tutorial videos.